welcome to Glowing Beauty with Jamie. And welcome back if you're one of my subscribers and a great big hello to any of my new subscribers. Today is, uh, it's been a while since I've been on here, I admit that. I've, uh, it's been crazy. We uh, had to move out of Bart's aunt's place, which was both a blessing and a curse. And well, we're moving, we're living in our motorhome again. Today I am coming home from the laundromat because of course living in a motorhome, we don't have a washer and dryer. And well, I met some very interesting people at the laundromat. So I could do story times on that experience. On my face today is only Gerard Cosmetics Mystify, along with their Eternal Eyeliner. And I think I got some CoverGirl mascara on, and that is it. So I just wanted to do a quick update because, like I said, I've been absent for a long time. I got new glasses, two new pairs actually. Um, got my hair cut, not that you can tell, but uh, it's it's been a Sorry, I had to pull over this new hold my camera tripod -y thingy. <sighs> it's not working that well. Anyway, I wanted just to give you guys a quick update to know that while I may not have been all that active on social media, that I am still around. And there's going to be a lot of updates coming soon. I've been working on editing all my footage of the house build, which is available over on my Patreon, which is listed down below. And uh, it's been exciting, guys. Um, I'm going to be putting up polls over on my Patreon very soon because I'm going to need like a lot of help as far as picking out, I don't know, faucets and window coverings and colors and all that interior stuff that is totally new to me. Like, I, it's overwhelming. All of it's overwhelming. Um, like, how's this for an awful photo angle, hey? <laughs> this thing keeps falling and I pull over to stop, to readjust it, but I also have to get home to pick up my boys from school. So, yeah, so I can't be fiddling too much and I refuse to do any of that stuff while I'm driving. But anyway, so far we have, um, well, they dug the hole, which will all be over on my Patreon. They dug the basement. They poured footings in the pouring rain. Not a nice day to be doing that. They put up all the styrofoam because our entire house is going to be called what's ICF, Insulated Concrete Forms, because the price of lumber is insane. So it was actually very comparable to build our entire house out of concrete, which is insanity. But uh, yeah, so they've got the basement walls poured. They put up the floor joists and everything, and I believe that they're actually laying the subfloor for our main floor today. But, uh, yeah, I just more or less wanted to let you guys know that I haven't disappeared. You haven't gotten rid of me. Um, it's just been crazy. Uh, we were in lockdown again, so the boys had a couple of weeks of online learning which, in my opinion, is a complete farce, but anyway, that's just my opinion. I have gotten my first vaccine, waiting to hear about getting my second vaccine. Um, yeah, moving again, I cannot, I can't even begin to tell you guys how excited I am at the thought of moving into this house and never ever in my entire life having to move again. Like, it's crazy. So, for the next little while, any videos that are up on this channel are probably going to be more vlog style because I am on the road all the time. Like, it is pretty close to an hour drive to the nearest city, per se, that's got a laundry mat. So, anytime I have to do laundry, 
uh, I'm on the road and I have two boys and we live on a farm and it is mud because we've had some rain and of course they strip away all the black dirt so then you're down to clay so not only is it just mud but it's that sticky slippery greasy gross mud <laughs> so that that makes a lot of laundry when you have two boys boys um my eldest he turned he had a birthday and he's growing up so fast and both boys are just they so love being out in the country again. You know, grandma and grandpa are across the road and it's it's one of those, it's a blessing and a curse situations because, uh, you know, they can be too in your business sometimes, but they're far enough away where you don't see them every day. And it's awful nice when the boys are like, they hop on the golf cart and they're just like, I'm gonna go see grandma and grandpa. And that is awesome. And grandma has been a godsend. There have been so many times that Bart and I have had to be running to pick something up or meeting with builders and all that type of thing. And grandma's just so willing and just loves spending time with her grandkids. And it's it's been nice. It has been really nice. Um, if any of you are ever in Camrose, there's a little place called Goat Coffee Shop fabulous. This is a blended chai. I've never had one before and it's fabulous. So yeah, so that's where I've been. I have not talked about a low buy. I don't, I think the last makeup that I bought was like a CoverGirl mascara just at the drugstore. I'm still getting my BoxyCharm. Contemplating canceling that subscription. The quality seems to be going down, and like I've mentioned in every BoxyCharm video that I do, I am so slow and so late to get a BoxyCharm box that it's almost pointless, right? And also now living in the motorhome, there's just not the space. Like every little thing you have to think, do I have room to store it? Where am I gonna put it? And but I will be giving you guys a house tour coming up and that'll be on this channel as well as over on my Patreon early. And uh, it's, and my channel membership, I totally forgot about that, that I was able to activate that. So everything will be early, available early on, um, on my channel membership and Patreon. And it's getting, it's so, difficult which is why I'm just gonna put my house videos in just over on my patreon to try to upload these things in three different places it's like oh, I go crazy and and there's been quite a few things that have been happening that you know I do want to share my opinions on um, the Tati without a crystal ball lawsuit being settled I, I get it I guess um, all this James Charles stuff all I'll say on that is there is a special place in hell for anybody who does things with minors if that is proven to be what happened or true um, yeah that's makes me feel ill especially being a mom right and my boys are at that age where you know they, they like to watch YouTube and I have the kids tube there but you know they're all of a sudden they're coming to me saying like oh well Mr. Beast this and it's like gosh I don't even watch Mr. Beast like then you feel like you have to do a deep dive and all these YouTubers like are they okay for my kids to be watching it's and it's all just so scary right so, so yeah, there's that, that just kind of, yuck. And then all these boxing matches, it's hilarious because except for the few YouTubers that I talk to on the regular, or talk about on the regular anyway with my hubby, like he knows them. But you know, all of a sudden out of the blue, he's asking me about Jake and Logan Paul and it's like, 
You guys are gonna be able to tell every time I've stopped along the side of the road. It's a great thing living out in the middle of nowhere because there's all these little field approaches that a guy can pull into because my camera angle changes. But uh, yeah, Bart all of a sudden asking me about Jake and Logan Paul, right? Because they're getting into the mainstream and boxing and that kind of thing. And it's like, I don't know. What I do know, it's not good per se, but yay on getting YouTubers in the mainstream, I guess. Um, yeah. So most of my time has just been spent on the road, which is why I figure this channel for the next little while might be more of a vlog style. So live a day in the life of, I guess it's like that RV life, right? <laughs> Except that it's not just a, a trip, it's I live in a camper. So, so yeah, it's the trials and tribulations. For the most part, I can make do. You know, I am that pioneer woman. But for things like having to do laundry, and I even have a great big wash tub, and I'll show you guys in a video, like I can do most laundry by hand, but there's some that you can't, or it's not easy to do, or you end up with weather like what we've been having where it's so rainy that a guy can't even hang it out on my clothesline. So, so yeah, it's been trying, but fun, kind of, and it's nice. We get to, you know, wake up and step out of our RV and look over at our house being built. And that's so exciting and stressful all at the same time. And with the uh, Panini situation that's going on, all the pricing is so ridiculous and it changes day to day. And it used to be that, you know, you could go to a home hardware and get a quote for all your lumber. You know, and it, the quote was good for six months or something. Now quotes are good for like three days, I think is the last I heard. So like even down to ordering a toilet bowl, like price is good for three days because every single thing has panini pricing in effect. So that has been crazy. But uh, let me know what you guys want to see. Do you want these on the road story times. I can tell you about some crazy laundry mat things. Uh, I don't know, tell you about life in my small town and that kind of thing. And we've had a sad little while here because a, uh, a coworker of Bart's, uh, his son, get teary eyed here while I'm turning. He uh, committed suicide. <clears throat> So everybody's been kind of dealing with that. Uh, you can't tell me that this Panini situation isn't having an effect on absolutely everybody's mental health. And I know that mine has suffered, but it's getting better. And uh, if anything positive came out, it was at least, you know, Bart and I were able to have a, a good talk about mental health and make sure we're both on the same page and aware of how each other's feeling and what's going on that type of thing so that was a positive thing to come out of it um but yeah so i guess that's my long rambling update like i said do you guys want some story times do you want some pioneer woman type videos i will still be doing beauty videos just uh when i find my stuff is part of it like this is not what a beauty YouTuber looks like. No. <laughs> well, it is. You know what? No, I retract that statement. This is what a beauty YouTuber looks like. But no, I don't, you know, I don't do a full beat every single day anymore. First off, because I don't know where half my stuff is. I've got a sunburn because I do every year. So who even knows what foundation would work. When I unpack all my stuff, I'm going to have to even see what what's good anymore, right? Like we were supposed to be building this house last year and it got put off. And so now it's like, oh my gosh, some of this stuff's been packed for a year. So I have to see full face doing expired products is going to be in the near future, I, I suspect. But I am just trying to make a mile here. This road always has great big B train grain trucks gravel trucks or whatever, the little town biking. 
it's a junction of a couple big highways. There's a lot of trucker traffic. And I always joke to Bart, he's like, I can never make it to town and not get stuck behind big vehicles. Or there's a military base not far away, so you get these big convoys of military vehicles, which my boys love, and they're always waving at all the military vehicles, and they love it. When you're trying to get somewhere in a hurry, though, it can be frustrating. Like I am now, I've got to pick up my boys from school, but the laundry mat took too long, and creepy people. So it's like I'm not sitting in the laundry mat when I got creepy people. Like a creepy guy that would stand right behind me when I was unloading a dryer, and he's like, You must be from a farm. I see you wear western jeans. Ugh. Ugh, heebie jeebies. Heebie jeebies. <laughs> so, anyway, yeah, story times are gonna be coming. Let me know. If you stuck around this long, thank you so much. I appreciate you guys more than you ever know. Um, sticking with me, even though I've taken these long absences, thank you. Thank you for spending some time with me, some, spending some of the time of your day just listening to me ramble. Um, I appreciate, I love it. I love you guys more than you'll ever know. So if you enjoyed this video, I don't even remember my outro. If you liked this video, give me a thumbs up. If you didn't, there's also a thumbs down. It's all engagement. Make sure you're subscribed with the bell on so that you're notified anytime I upload new content. And until next time, love you guys. Bye. So now I've given up because that silly thing, Angie fell